Welcome to Nichols Retirement Empire House Cleaning Edition number two. Um, my job cleaning the house, I do two things. I do the bathrooms, I do the floors. Now, if you want to subject yourself to one of the most stressful parenting situations you can possibly enter into, try to teach your teenager how to sweep the floor. Because I do the floors. And it can be one of the most unbelievable events of your life to try to teach them how to sweep the floor. Um, and you know they're, you know, they're, it's like when they're a kid, when they're little, you know, or even when they're teenagers, you know they're attracted to the dirt and stuff like that because if you ever sweep a pile up in the middle of the floor, you know, like I got this pile right here, they're going to run straight to it. They're going to run or walk right through it and get, they, they, they are, they are, you know, kind of pulled toward it. But now when it comes to actually learning how to sweep, I, 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 it's unbelievable. Yeah. A lot of people, uh, they don't realize that and then unaware they get caught up in it. But I happen to know how this works. Um, a lot of people think, well, Teaching my teenager to drive was really stressful, and that really, you know, this is worse than teaching your teenager how to drive. Um, and not all teenagers are like this, but the ones that are, it, it's, un, it's like it, you put a broom in their hand and tell them to sweep, and it's like they turn into a three-year-old. They have no... <laughs> it's like, you know, they, it, it could be that they've taken geometry, and they've taken advanced math classes, and they can't understand the space and what you're supposed to do you know they don't understand that you start you know on the outside and sweep to the inside you know and put all the stuff in a pile they have no concept of, of space they have no and, and, and then and, and when they sweep you get uh, you get different things like you'll get this is the one my favorite is the that sweeping where they push the broom down on the ground and, and they're doing little bitty tiny it's like they're trying to knock the, I don't know what they think I don't know what they think is happening when they're sitting here doing this but they do that uh, and then you get the ones that do the big you know like they're out there sweeping a sidewalk you know they don't understand that they're in a room um, I've seen them and I'm gonna tell you I have seen them on buses like the bus drivers get this bright idea you know I'm gonna make the kids clean up the bus because they left a bunch of garbage out. you know and I would always go okay yeah that's a good idea you know because I was the bus administrator and I would say yeah uh, if you want to keep them on the bus and their parents are okay with that stay on the bus have them clean up the bus but s sweeping a bus is that that's uh, that's advanced sweeping because you got all those seats and they're all attached to the floor I mean you really have to understand and know how to sweep and I have seen those bus drivers. I try not to even get around it. That they would hand that broom to those kids and those kids try to sweep that bus. And I mean, it's, it's you know, it is the craziest thing. You have, they can't. It's like they, they can't do it. I mean, you want to know why a restaurant, why kids can't keep... I mean, if you ask, go find a restaurant. If you know a restaurant manager, go find a restaurant manager and ask them how kids sweep and, and how... They and, and, and they can be 20 years old, and I mean, it, it, it's like there's just no, they don't know what's going on with the brain. It's, it's really crazy. But go find one and ask them, and you'll find out. Um, but I mean, probably the worst thing, like when we tried to teach one of my dogs, one of them could sweep, the other one couldn't. When we tried to teach her how to sweep, it was like, what is happening? What are you doing to this floor? Uh, and I'm going to tell you something else, mopping. Mopping. Let me show you a mopping technique you're really going to enjoy. Mopping. <laughs> I had this kid one time that made this big mess, like he turned over a bunch of garbage cans playing around. And uh, he had actually gotten into an area where he was not supposed to be and turned the garbage. So he was in a lot of trouble. 
And so I called his dad up and I told his dad, listen, I'm going to have to do this. You know, I told him what the consequence was going to be and all this kind of thing. And the dad goes, well, look, do me a favor. I said, what? He said, would you make him clean it up? Since he's made, he goes, has it been cleaned up? I said, no, it hasn't been cleaned up. He goes, well, could you make him clean it up? I'm like, huh? yeah, that's what you want me to do? Yeah, I'll do it. And so I took the kid down to the place, you know, where it was all messed up. And when the garbage cans turned over, he got stuff on the floor. So I thought, well, I'm going to make him mop it up. So I went and I got a mop and a mop pail and all that kind of stuff. And I didn't even attempt to try to tell him how to wring the mop out. or I knew better than that. I was just, you know, I got the mop ready, hand him the mop, you know. You need to mop this stuff up, all that stuff on the floor. And he took that mop, and he took it, and he kind of looked, the look on his face was like, you know, it was like a cow staring at a new gate. I mean, he was just like, you know. And he took the mop, and he started doing like this. <laughs> and it's, it's, he just started doing like that. And so I'm standing here watching him. And I'm looking at him like, are you kidding me? <laughs> I mean, he was like, what is, what is he doing? Is he trying to drive me crazy? And I mean, I've dealt with kids 30 years. I mean, I know exactly how, to, you know, and, and all of a sudden I just started thinking, oh my God, I'm going to have to kill this kid. And then, and then it, you know, I regained control of myself and I looked at him and I realized, I'm like, he's not trying to mess with me and be funny. He, he really, he just didn't know. I could tell by looking at you. He he was just he was gonna do the whole floor like that, and I was like, dude, let, let me show you something here. And so I showed him how to mop the floor. Uh, but it is just unbelievable. This concept right here. Look at this. The idea that you pick this stuff up off the floor and, and put it on a table and then clean the floor. Well, I mean that's like brain surgery to them. I mean it's like what I mean they have no concept they just think if there's something in the floor you can't you know that's a space that doesn't get mopped doesn't get clean so uh, if you want an adventure I mean an adventure I, I challenge you find a, uh, one of your grandchildren find one of your kids find somebody that's a teenager and try to teach them how to sweep and just sit back and watch Nichols Retirement Empire go out there and teach your kids how to sweep if you can retire, do it. Have a good day.